Hello friends, welcome to LR.com. LR.com provides training in Microsoft SQL Server technology. My name is Vikas Munjal. So SQL Server is a relational database management system. So I can say is it, a, it is a software and the databases are just the files. We query this software like we say insert the data, select the data, update the data and uh, we also query for backup of the data. So all these things we do on the software. Okay, and this software interact with the database files and uh, give us the desired result. So this SQL Server is a software. Now this software is used as a window service. Now window service means that it is a service which is installed on window operating system. Uh, if I go to uh, start, there is a configuration manager. If you write SQL Server Configuration Manager In Configuration Manager there are services So this is a SQL Server service which is installed Actually this is your Relational Database Management System or this is a software which I am talking about It is installed as a window service SQL Server is a service so suppose this is SQL Server which is a service now this service is connected to databases so one service can connect to many different databases in fact these are all relational databases because the data is stored in the form of tables now and every database will have multiple tables inside it now what I have to do I have to perform the select operation I want to perform uh, I want to insert something into the, these tables I want to update these tables or I want to delete these tables or I need to take the backup of these databases so I have to talk to SQL Server service for that one interface is provided which is called SSMS the full form of SSMS is SQL Server Management Studio so it is actually an interface which can connect to SQL Server and it can understand these commands so through SSMS which is an interface uh, you write the select command, insert command and update command and these commands will be sent to SQL Server and then SQL Server will will either get the information from the files or perform some modification operation into the file. Now I go to start and I type SQL Server Management Studio. Now here it is asking me the server name. I will put localhost. Localhost represents my my SQL server which is installed on my local machine. So now what I will do? I will hit connect. So it means through SQL Server Management Studio, I am connected to SQL Server Database Engine. Now if I go to database, I can select the data I can take the backup and do all this stuff for example if I right click on this go to task I can take the backup of the database also if I go to tables there are so many tables I right click and select the data from these tables so it is just an interface which is through which I am talking to SQL Server or I am I am connected to SQL Server some people have misconception they think that this SSMS is SQL Server but no it is just an interface on which you are doing your development work or management work. Please click on the like button if you find this video useful and for more videos please subscribe my YouTube channel. I also write blog posts.
and for more information please visit my website www.lr.com thank you for watching this video